nika confirm whether kani ukweli wa wangu ajanyesha mm. nikakuja nikapata ni ukweli ajanyesha ako positive ako na ball mm-hmm. after nilipata ako na ball sasa nikajua sasa hapa ni kujituma kimwanaume sasa mm. like i've already how now sasa niko na family sasa mm. naweza tulima the opinion expressed in this interview are those of the interviewee they do not purport or reflect the opinions or views of the host and or Mwangi Chris brand and or its members thank you for watching this video please subscribe to watch more of our content Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Ina depend hii video una watch saa gapi? Na kila time tunasamaga ni salamu, salamu, salamu because we are all family. And being a family, it is a good thing. And today it's my privilege to be somewhere called Ma Matu. Yeah, Matu. Hiyo <laughs> jina Matu na Mala huwa inaendanisha sana. Lakini leo tuko Matu place inaitwa mwenye tumetembelea leo uh, atatuambia huko kuna itwa aje ama hii place inaitwa aje kama wewe ni mkamba uh, leo tunachanganya kikava mahali tukiuliza uh, mwenye mgeni wetu leo tukimuuliza mm-hmm. sisi kusema hivi na kikamba ni nini <laughs> and uh, uh, i know it's been a while lakini now we are here again uh, we are here to thank you all for the support and keep on supporting the channel that we are watching if you find something good you just uh, appreciate it and then you support it now it's my privilege to welcome this guy vipi hey, yes yes kwani umestuka ah sijastuka haujaji ona bele ya camera ah niko tu sawa niko sawa i'm okay watu wanakuitaga aje naitwa joshua somba eh eh mimi ni mwenye joku matu eh matu ndo nimeleleo umelelo huko yapo. Hii place inaitwa aje. Hii place place yenye tuko mm. eh wenye umetembea matu mm-hmm. hapa place hii place inaitwa posta ama nasi. Eh yep. Ah posta ama nimeona ni a very devil. Where watu huwa wanakuza nini hapa? Huku kwa sababu naona ni place zinakaa mzuri sana. Ah uh, huku biashara zenye watu hufanya mm. wanaweza fanya biashara za za sana sana unajua huko kwenye shangi sana mm-hmm. unaona mvua ni less mm-hmm. so biashara mingi huko mm-hmm. watu ni zile za kuuza mifugo aha like uh, naonaga watu kwa plot wakisema huko uh, plot ni 250 200 unaweza advise mtu anunue plot huko <laughs> yep hizo uh. zina kwa gastori tu huko uh. plot za huko ziko fit <laughs> biashara huko ziko tu sawa uh. then the, the environment is okay mm. yep Ah good. Sasa wewe ni nani? Okay. Personally kwa majina nimesema naitwa Joshua Somba. Mm-hmm. Mimi ni XNOS mm-hmm. ama Hans and Anasla pia. Mm-hmm. Mimi ni mwenyeji huku mm-hmm. ama youth pia. Mm-hmm. Uh, about my Yeah, oh okay. Oh sorry. <laughs> At least ushajibu ile tunakuwa nikikuuliza uh, huwa you by the way, hiyo umejibu ya ukweli. So umesomea huku ama umesomea wapi? Nimesomea huku mm-hmm. kutoka primary school mm-hmm. to secondary school. Okay. Yep. So ulikuwa umeniambia ulimaliza ukaenda NYS. Yep. Then Okay, my life ya NOS mm. nilienda NOS 2017. Mm-hmm. March mm. day 23. Mm-hmm. So nikaingia NHS pale Gilgil nikafanya paramilitary training. Mm. Six months nikatoka hapo nikaenda Katundu mm. nikafanya my national building there. Mm-hmm. Nikatoka hapo nikapost mm-hmm. nikapata class mm. class inje. Mm. Nikaenda place inaitwa Moranga mm. Michuki Technical. Mm-hmm. Nikafanya course nitangwa Automotive Engineering. Mm-hmm. Yep. Oh hiyo ni engineering ya mabarabara ya magari ama automotive so hiyo lazima iwe magari 
Okay. Yeah. Mechanic ama wiring. Hiyo ni ina deal na zote. Oh zote. Yeah. So sahi gari ikikuja ikwame you are okay. I'm okay. <laughs> uh -huh. I can sort it out. So vile ulimaliza NYS. Yeah. Uh, life ikakuaje? Eh After niliingia NYS, uh -huh. uh, nikapata shule Moranga. Mhm. Uh -huh. Nikaanza kufanya course yangu ya engineering course. Uh -huh. After nilipata nimeitwa huko unajua siko najua kama nitapata class yenyewe uh -huh. unajua ukiwa hano uh has -huh. the time that you are choosing your course uh -huh. unapeangwa u choose course tatu uh -huh. zenye unaweza taka kufanya uh -huh. so after nili choose tatu yenye uh -huh. nilikuwa nimepeana ya mwisho uh -huh. ndio nilipitiwa na nikapewa class yenyewe uh -huh. na nikaitwa Moranga uh -huh. after kufika Moranga uh, school life ikaanza uh -huh. schedule ya shule ikaanza masomo ikaanza So ukapata kuna challenges fulani nilikuwa napitia mm -hmm. for the start of the term simply mm -hmm. because uh, nimeitiwa engineering course mm -hmm. nimeitwa Moranga is a mm -hmm. new area mm -hmm. shule pia niko na new friends hapo mm -hmm. nikaanza kupata na challenges so. mm -hmm. uh, nikafika shule mm -hmm. nikianza course ukapata kuna requirements zilikuwa zinatakikana for example like uh, niko nataka kitu kama geometrical set mm. niko nataka keyboard t square drawing board dusty coat apron na vitu zingine so ukapata nyumbani like they were not able to provide those mm. things uh. so who was paying the school fees the nyrs was catering for the accommodation oh, na, oh so uh, nyrs who do you want to provide eh? yeah want to provide oh, okay Yeah. Mm -hmm. So nikiwa pale shule eh nikianza course yangu hapo si mwalimu amesema leka amesema kama ni ni unit ya TD technical drawing kuja na technical nini board yako nini T square sasa nikakuwa na challenges nikipigia mzazi nyumbani like hello dad i'm supposed to have a geometric set ananiuliza kijana geometric set uko Moranga in a cost how much namwambia mm -hmm. dad huku kale kadogo napata kanozo wa dhao mhm like haamini mhm like haamini kama kuna set ya mm. ya dhao mm. namwambia dad huku tao huku 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 moranga mm -hmm. like na fani wana drawing board mhm anamuli ananiuliza ni ya pesa ngapi mm. namwambia ni 2500 ama 2000 mm. like he wasn't believe be mm -hmm. kwa hizo vitu namwambia sorry So mimi nikiwa pale shule nikasema acha nijitume kama wale wasi wengine because I was there to nurture myself mm -hmm. so nikaona like wacha nifikirie vile nitajisaidia nikiwa shule mm -hmm. so nikaanza biashara nikachanuka nikaanza kuuza malolo mm -hmm. nikauza lolo hapo nikienda class na beba lolo naenda mm -hmm. nauzia ma classmates lolo dio nini sweet oh. zile lollipop okay. so nikaanza kuuza hizo ma sweets mm -hmm. shule ikafika mm -hmm. ina in a area where like pa pa day mm. nazo ata packet tatu unajua mm -hmm. packet moja iko na profit ya 250 mm. so hiyo ni kujituma tu kimwanaume eh mm. kama kujituma mm -hmm. after niliamua kujituma that's why that's how nili manage kununua zile vitu za shule zilizokuwa zinatakikana mm. nikafanya course yangu hapo nikamaliza time ya corona mm. back in 0 2020 mm -hmm. yeah after there nikatoka nikaingia nikatoka shule mm. nikaanza kuhaso kusaka mm. haso mm -hmm. after nilianza kusaka haso nikakuja kwanza nikafanya kazi kwa microfinance fulani mm. ilikuwa inaitwa jirani smart mm -hmm. ikani post huku huku matu nilianza huku matu nikanipeleka ikanipiga transfer di hembu mm. nikafanya hembu nikiwa hembu mm -hmm. nika save unajua sasa unapokuma una save mm. so nika save after nili save nikaona like mali imefika sasa naweza jiajiri mm -hmm. so nika nika quit job mm -hmm. nikakuja nikanunua bike mm -hmm. motor bike mm -hmm. so nikarudi huku nyumbani nikasema because huku ilikuwa mm -hmm. inakaa like biashara ya bike inashika sana mm -hmm. wacha mimi nijari nijaribu mm -hmm. mimi nikaanza kupiga nikaanza kupiga aso yangu na bike huku mm -hmm. then there uh, 
after sasa nimesikia like now I'm well up kidogo mm-hmm. like uh, I'm supposed to have a family mm-hmm. kama jama like so kisha pata do like uko fit like una mm-hmm. we need a family we umejipanga kimwanaume sana unaanza mm-hmm. mm-hmm. so unaanza life mm-hmm. ona mm-hmm. so there's a lady mm-hmm. mwenye tulipata nanga sasa nikiwa attachment kwa eno has mm-hmm kaanza ku date ku date ku date akamaza shule mm. that time sasa nikikuja kununua bike mm. like alikuwa shamaliza shule mm. she was there na then relationship yetu ilikuwa mm. shaka kwa strong mm. so the lady because uh, alikuwa within alikuwa around matu mm. we arranged to meet and talk mm-hmm. tukaelewana mm. tukaanza like life yetu kanza mm-hmm. life tena fresh sasa ile ile tuko tunafanya sasa ni ku date mm-hmm. sasa tukaanza wa normal life tukaanza life yetu na yeye mm. kwa kusema normal life ni kumaanisha mlikalishana na yeye like sasa hapo like tulipata na tukaongea mm-hmm. tukaelewana tukasema like because she was working here mm-hmm. na mimi sasa mimi unajua sasa niko na bike mm. sana nafaa ku fetch money mm. namrudisha kwao mm. namleta job money mm. jioni namrudisha mm-hmm. so nikamwambia because uh, nashinda niki travel sana niki commute kutoka hii place hadi place mm. rather than because we are dating have we, and we have dated for long mm-hmm. tunaanza marriage life mm-hmm. sawa tuka propose tukakuja huku matu tukakomboa nyumba mm-hmm. tukaanza wa marriage life hapo mm-hmm. so tukaka like 2 to 3 weeks mm-hmm. then tukaona because tushaanza kukaanisha unajua uwezi kana na mtu mm-hmm. na watu hawajika unaishi na mtu mm-hmm. watu hawajui ni nini mnaendeleza mm-hmm. unaona mm-hmm. so mimi nika nika propose because nilikuwa uh, nishafika hiyo stage ya marriage mm-hmm. let me confirm hii issue mm-hmm. na ma maparo wangu kwanza mm-hmm. so nikaenda home nikaonana na mzazi wangu wazazi wangu my mom my dad mm-hmm. nikawaambia the issue nikawaambia na stress na issue na mstana nini 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 hivyo hivyo tulipendana na tushaanza mm-hmm. life na liko na yeye na sharend nyumba mm-hmm. already tunaishi na yeye <laughs> the first the first time mm-hmm. dio new introduce my wife to my parents huh? by that day ulikuwa unafanya kazi gani that time that time ulikuwa unafanya kazi gani nimekwambia nilienda hembu nikafanya kazi nika save oh nikakuwa na do okay, sasa okay. nikimekuja no oh, oh yeah yeah okay okay hauko na any business umeweka i was not having any business nilikuwa so ulisema hizi tunakula na bewagu <laughs> no it's not that eh. like uh, first of all nilikuwa nimesakia wife wangu wera anafanya job na mimi because i was doing niko nafanya boda boda oh that's nice that's yeah. why i wanted to understand eh yeah. hiyo yeah. time niko mm-hmm. nafanya boda boda mm-hmm. wife wangu alikuwa anafanya super mm-hmm. so to kona like to sawa eh yeah, to go mm-hmm. to sawa mm-hmm. sasa the first introduction ndio ni muoneshane kwa wife mm-hmm. nienda home mm-hmm. nikamwambia my dad eh hey dad niaje yeah, on sunday nataka tuonane mm-hmm. lakini sitaki tuona ni huko soko nataka mm-hmm. kwanza sitaki tuona ni huko home mm-hmm. nataka ukuje soko tuona ni huko soko kuna kitu nataka tuonge mm-hmm. tuonge that sunday my dad akanipigia kaniuliza kijana uko wapi mm-hmm. nikamwambia mm-hmm. so tukaenda tukapatana na my dad mm-hmm. nikamwambia mimi personally kaja jamaa mimi nishaamua kuoa mm-hmm. na already niko na msichana kwa nyumba mm-hmm. na leo nataka nikupeleke ukamuone mm-hmm. So even ndo tulianza tukaenda na my dad akaona msichana kutoka hapo akarudi home akaambia mande mande nikamleta akaona msichana kutoka mm-hmm. hapo nikachukua msichana tukaenda kwetu akaona kwetu akaona maparo wangu mm-hmm. alafu sasa tukarudi tukaanza normal life yeah. sasa after there progress ya marriage mm-hmm. ikaanza mm-hmm. tuko organize mimi nikaenda kwa msichana kona kwao kona kongea na msingo uh, mada ikongea na mamake mm. tukaitikiana everything mm. from there uh, tuko organize una do huku kambani like when you are marrying a lady mm. uh, 
there are some things that you have to follow. Uwe zienda uchukua msichana wenyewe, alafu unamweka kwako. Like, kuna vitu vinafaa ufuate. So, tuko ganezi. Isi wakiku tunasama gano la show. Ama the, the, nini ya kwanza, kupanda nini. Ya. Siju ina itago aje. Kwenu mula itago aje, kupanda. Kwenu mula itago aje, the first visit. Ile ya kwanza. Kupeleka. Kupeleka ini itango andeo. Ndeo. 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 So, iyo ilikuwa back on 0.21. 2021. Iyo, iyo, sasa iyo time ndo nilifanya iyo story. Iyo ye nakombia. So, tukatoka hapo. My parents wakatoka, wakaenda kwao. Tuka agree, tuka fanya. Mpaka place yenye married. Sasa tumemaliza the story za married. Sasa nika officially married man. Sasa. So, on my... On my marriage life now, apo sasa ndio nili experience everything yenye sasa mse ukitia. That time, tumekuja tumeseto, wife wanafanya kazi, minafanya kazi. So, unajua minafanya kazi ya boda. Na kazi ya boda yu time siyezi sema ilikuwa mzuri ya mambaya, lakini ilikuwa nga mzuri because yu time ilikuwa ina inanipea veva. That time nilikuwa naeza manage family, naeza fanya, naeza afford everything. Yenye inatakikana kwa family. Ona? So tukakana my wife. Tukakana my wife for four months. After tunimaliza four months, because like the aim of marriage ni kama upate to expand for me, to procreate, to put them to eat, and what do you only like, to mend in a step. I can't think of my own, I can't think of my own pressure, I can't think of my own, I can't think of my own. Then the wife, to kick on her, like, a party of my own. I had to make her for four months, huh? So, hiyo time, ikabidi hii ishu, tumeyongelelea, nikapigia my dad, nikamambia mimi, nimekana wifu wangu, tukona ishu, patangi bol, tukenda, tukambia mamake, tukona ishu, mstena patangi bol. Mulienda hosi, ama mbuli guestu? Iyo ni hile kugestu, liongea, naturally, because tukona wewe kwa nyumba, for four months, na hakuna kitu inaonekana. Na unajua sasa, that time we are spending, we are tunafanya bitu mingi, like, natusha wawana. Like, we read that time leader akida. Yani muliamua kupima kia kiri, hamu kwe data hausi kuagaliwa kama liwewe, ama liyei. Mi mwenyewe sasa ndo niliamua kupima. So, what happened, because nikuwa nafikiria, labda, waifu ndo wakona hishu, na hiyo time nikona maybe, pia mindo naeza kuwa na hishu. So hiyo time, because kama mwanaume, ulajwa kama mwanaume ukidate, uwezi date mde moda. Semi uwezi, lakini unaeza date. You can be loyal, but yezi kuwa that 100%. Inaeza, at a time, in a family, but in a dating way, yezi kuwa that. So, that time, nikasema, let me try. Kwa ule mde mfulani, nikuanga na date halia. Because there is another lady, mwenye tukua tuna date. Nikuwa na hita, baby. Kama umstiana party ball, baby, mindo nikona shida, maendo nakona shida. Nikasema, wacha, wacha niende, nijaribu na ule umstiana mwingine, maybe if it will work, nione maybe nani ya kona hishu. Mwona? Sami nikaenda nikakana mstiana. Tukakana ee. Like, nikama na jificha. Hapo time naeza sema ni kujificha. Because nikama I was... Nakana wife batajui. Naenda inje. So, tukakana ho mstiana for four months. Haka kosa kupata ball. Uwa pili? Ee, uwa pili haka kosa kupata ball. So, after likosa kupata ball, sasa tukarudi tena nikambia wife mimi 
mimi naona like uh, because we are spending we are doing everything na nakupenda in fact you msichana nampenda sana uh, let us take another step ndo mm-hmm. akani propose akaniambia my mom anaweza sort out issue yetu ikamuliza your mom anaweza sort out anaweza sort out aje issue ya mtoto msichana akaniambia my mom huwa naombea watu na anaweza tuombea na to reform atupate mtoi nikamwambia ni sawa organize with your mom twende tukamtembelee akapigia mamake simu tukaongea na mama kwa simu na tukaelewana after tulielewana uh, tukatoka hapo to we plan a day tukaenda kwa kina msichana kapatana na mamake because she comes from a single single nene na single parent uh, kapatana na mamake tukaongea na mamake nikamwambia issues mamake akatuombea after lituombea normal prayer just a normal prayer si unaonanga vile ukienda kwa mother in law vile anakuaga na heshima like Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So akani treat hivyo akatuombea alafu tukarudi. Si kurudi huku mm. tukaanza biashara zetu. Mm-hmm. Yo time uh, my wife place alikuwa anafanya ikapata like iko na some challenges uh, like uh, payment yake ikuje uh, vile ina five kuje. So mm-hmm. akaacha job akakaa nikako kwa nyumba. Ni kama mimi ndo namlea hiyo time na mimi sasa si tumeanza kukaa tumemaliza kama almost a month mm. wife akakuja akaniambia aje like uh, uh, i was supposed ku nitaje kunyesha mm if atwe vira tumesema eh alikuwa anafaa kunyesha hiyo mwezi <laughs> so hiyo mwezi akunyesha after mm. tumetoka maombi mm-hmm. akaniambia by the way after tuliombewa mm a uh, ile nini yangu ya mwezi mm-hmm. nikamuuliza what do you mean akaniambia mimi sijanyesha totally sijanyesha nikamwambia uh, kama hujanyesha wacha tuipe time then the other lady mwenye tukua tuna tuna have some some time na yeye uh, tuka break up tuka break up tukaachana Mm. ukapata ni kama like you are not talking like ni kama imeshaisha because mimi sasa because wife washa niambia like hajapata nini na hiyo ndio nilikuwa nataka kwa family but sasa wacha tuachane na mhm and that led me sasa i be loyal to the family wewe oh, mwingine ulikuwa umemwambia nimekuja kwako je sababu fulani ah ah we were just dating like vile uh, mse huwa na date na mtu na alikuwa na jo umeoa Ah, hiyo time ako na joka nimeoa. Okay, okay. Aha. Sasa, hiyo msichana mwingine eh tukaachana. After tuliachana mimi kasema let me commit myself ku kwa kwa familia yangu because msichana acha niambie like uh, aje nini na like ako na ball. Oh. Mm. But si kwa ni confirm ameniambia janyesha but sija confirm mm. so tukaipea time then after ile time tuko tunaipea tuko tunaipea week time mm. uh, the other lady akanipigia simu akaniambia mimi because tuliachana sioni need ya kushinda nikikaa hii mta let me shift niende nikaishinda best yangu Nairobi mm-hmm. so the other lady akaenda Nairobi mm. after nienda Nairobi mimi nikabaki huku after nilibaki huku the following week nika confirm whether kani ukweli wa wife wangu ajanyesha mm. nikakuja nikapata ni ukweli ajanyesha ako positive ako na ball mm-hmm. after nilipata ako na ball sasa nikajua sasa hapa ni kujituma kimwanaume sasa mm. like i've already how now sasa niko na family sasa mm. naweza tulia mm leza jikaza sasa kimwanaume sasa mm-hmm. so nikatulia na familia yangu tukatulia tukamaliza mwezi after tulimaliza mwezi the other lady called me mm-hmm. 
Aliniambia by the way after nitoka huko Matu nikaenda Nairobi Miss Danyesha pia. Hmm. Sasa yule mstari na mwingine akanipigia akaniambia mimi pia ni Miss Danye. Mhm. Sijanyesha nikamuuliza ujanyesha aje na tulikuwa tushaachana. Sasa like tushaachana like kidi. Ya ambia Danyesha. Na alafu wewe uko hapa kwa nyumba. Hiyo ndio defense ya mwanaume. Aje na tuliachana. Eh aje na tuliachana like a month ago. Not knowing mliachana lakini mlikuwa mshafanya mambo yenu. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so after aliniambia Janyesha nikamwambia ni sawa wewe fanya aje because mimi kukuamini ukiwa Nairobi kuna issue wewe kuja matu ni confirm mimi mwenyewe unjanyesha unajua mwanaume anatakanga ku confirm by action uone you believe na ile unaona mwanaume sana sana huwa na belief na kitu anaona hey wapi huko ulifanya aje unafaa oh you wanted to see ulikuwa unataka kuona haje nilikuwa nataka ni confirm ni mfanyie test mi mwenyewe like ni confirm umfanyie test aje like i nili after tuliorganize nikamwambia kuja kuja huko matu tuonane aka drop aka kuja matu after nikuja matu nikaenda chemistry oh. nikabai kids i thought uh -huh. nikaenda kumtest okay okay after nilienda mm. nikapata kwa na ball mhm mm nipata kwa na ball ah <laughs> sijui ni shetani ama ni nini nitokea hapo sasa after mm. niniambia kwa na ball issues zikaanzia hapo because that time don nimeanza family my wife pia nimepata kwa na ball na the other lady ya kwa na ball So the other lady nikamwambia because mimi naturally nikamwambia mimi naturally because uh, I don't feel weather mm. uh, nilikuwa gakepe boku nilikuwa na like nikamwambia because tukua tutachana mm. atuweze rudiana because uko na ball so the best way ni to try to solve tuone mm. tutafanya aje uh, that time na wife wangu akapata job. Mm -hmm. After alipata job, akaanza kufanya job na OC. Mm -hmm. OC yenye kwa huko. Akaanza kufanya job hapo OC. Sasa si yashajua, unajua yeye ni wife na amejua kwa na ball. Sasa mm -hmm. yeye shtuki because mm -hmm. anajua sana like we are this guy is my man. Mm -hmm. Lakini ajui kana nilikuwa na msichana mwingine na nimepata kwa na ball. Nikuuliza hapo. Yeah. Ulikuwa unaenda kwa huyo mwingine eh? Mm -hmm juu huyu wako hapati miba. What if sasa huyu angepata miba, huyu wako akose kupata. Ungewa huyo mwingine waachane na huyu? Ah uh, no. Nope. Ulikuwa unataka tu ku test. Nilikuwa nataka nione ni ukweli siwezi pata, siwezi pata mtoto. That's why nili experiment by action na mtu mwingine. Uh, another lady or oh, your ex girlfriend my ex girlfriend uh, tukaifanya so kuifanya kumbe ile maombi huko tuliombewa maombi ni changamka na huyo mwingine muliombewa huyo mwingine hatuko tumeombewa <laughs> na yeye so after tuliombewa <laughs> sasa ndo hey. tukapata kwa na ball Is wife wa kwa na ball sasa the issue ikakuja ku rise up the the side chick mwenye akona ball mm. alikuwa anafaa kuingia shule by sep mm -hmm. because ako campus mm -hmm. alikuwa anafaa kurudi shule saa hiyo time akurudi shule akona ball hakuna mtu kwao anajua kona ball mm. mimi ndo najua kona ball sasa so, kukaanza kuwa na issues anaambia babe nitaenda shule na ball anambia wewe tulia ukienda shule tutajua vile tuta sort out ndakuwa ukienda shule ukifika shule ndaka moranga tubonge tuone vile tutaelewa mm -hmm. tutaelewana tuone vile tuta sort out issue akaniambia ni sawa msichana akarudi shule akiwa na ball akaenda kamba sakiwa na ball mimi nikaacha huku sasa nikiwa huku sasa na mimi ni kulea family nikijipanga niende wapi mm. niende moranga nikashughulikia ball na because kama wanaume because 
hii kitu pia nilishtua mimi mm. decision yenye nili come up with it kama mtu nilisema like because acha pata ball wacha tu kubali tu link mm-hmm. wacha tu ile wacha tu ile tu because hapa kuna hadha we cannot do a ball shot mhm eh stena kakana ball mm-hmm. wakafunga shule wakakujio december hiyo december bado niko na wife wangu na lea ball ya wife wangu sasa ishaanza mm-hmm. ishaanza kunini sasa nishapigia mzazi wangu nikamwambia wife wangu alipata ball tunaishi fi mm-hmm. tunaishi fiti sasa mm-hmm. Sasa marriage yangu ishasonga. Mhm. Eh msichana nayo kiwa shule mm-hmm. ball ikaanza ikaanza kutokea. Sasa sometimes anampigia anambia babe unajua niko nafa kwenda class. I ball na feel like feel fit in kitembea nayo. Mm-hmm. Unajua hakuna mse anaweza not kako nayo mm-hmm. but I feel fit that time I feel fit akiwa nayo. Mm-hmm. Si wakafunga shule hiyo mm-hmm. December kakamu. December tukaonana hiyo hiyo holiday tukaonana tukabonga sasa ikakaa like sasa aingie tena by mm-hmm. January mm-hmm. arudi tena shule mm-hmm. sasa jana ikafika anafaa kurudi shule home kwao hakuna mtu anajua kaka kuna ball lakini ball iko mm-hmm. lakini ija grow sana iko lakini ija grow nile like anaificha na dress nini like hakuna mse anaweza not Sims chana akarudi shule. Sasa that process mimi sasa nimekwambia nilikuwa na hasa na bike. Ile bike yangu ikakuja ikaibiwa. Yeye <laughs> alikuwa na hasa nayo. <laughs> so ikakaa mimi like mimi sina hasa sasa. Mm-hmm. Eh, sasa sina hasa, sina place naweza naweza hand sasa na niko na wife. Eh, sasa mimi nikaamua kimwanaume ndo ni recover tena nitoke kwa situation yenye niko wacha nichukue wife wangu because nishaamua kumooa mm-hmm. turudi nyumbani mm-hmm. twende tukaishi naye ushago mm-hmm. nikachukua wife wangu tukaenda ushago kwa ushago stana naye amerudi shule mimi sina bike bike imebiwa totally dibiwa na mwenyele 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 ni bio bike manze nilikusamea mtanga ukiniona unajificha mhm weka na bike ulijua ni nani eh a friend of mine alimkilia okay, okay. mhm ha tutamtaja hapa okay hiyo ya eh mimi nimesamea eh nimesamea akaenda hiyo bike hata haina mambo lakini ni costi sana uh-huh. so uh-huh. ukarudisha bibi nyumbani mimi karudisha nikarudisha bibi nyumbani mm-hmm. tukaanza life yetu mm-hmm. yo shago mm-hmm. tukaanza kuishi shago tukaanza kuishi shago nikaanza kutafuta vile nita survive Bishtangu akani connect na na, na job nikatoka mm-hmm. home nikaenda nikaenda Nairobi nikaanza mm-hmm. nikaenda Nairobi Westlands mm-hmm. nikaanza kufanya job huko mm-hmm. sasa nikiwa job ule msichana akiwa shule mm-hmm. akanipigia akaemphasize sana mm-hmm. like tupatane mm-hmm. tupatane like tuonane anataka wow. kuniona mm-hmm. but hiyo time niko busy na unajua sasa sha rudi shule miss day ona ball bila natoshana nini mm-hmm. nini analialia sana nikamwambia ni sawa kama utamanage kuja tao because mimi si uko well up mm. nikijipanga nakwambia sasa hii si uko fit mm. unaona si uko fit nataka nijifanye kazi nijipange ndo mm. mkikuja kujifungua niko na mimi niko fit mm-hmm. unaona so your time um dem ka dwele pressure shule like akashindwa na masomo like ana feel i the so man i your ball mm ah akanipigia simu akaniambia kama hujapata do yenye unaweza manage tukuje kuonana mimi nitatuma do nitasaka do nikutumie do ukuje tao tuonane na wewe nikamwambia ni sawa tukakaa hiyo day usiku msichana akanitumia pesa kaniambia kesho kesho morning tupatanie tao tuongee alafu tuonane yeah eh hiyo time mimi hiyo job nilikuwa nafanya because nilikuwa nimeandikwa na mzee mwenye alikuwa ananielewa nenda mm-hmm. nikamwambia nataka the following day and pay off mm-hmm. niende ni kuna mali nataka kwenda kuna kazini yangu mali mm-hmm. nataka niende nionane na yeye mm-hmm. alafu nirudi but the following day taingia kazi mhm huyo jamaa kanielewa kanipea off so the following day nikaamka asubuhi nikakuja hadi town nikapatana na msichana <laughs> 
kapatana na msichana that was the first time kumuona na ball sasa unajua ile time nyingine alikuwa anakuja na ball nika ameficha because mm. na muita tuonane tunaonania place open yeah. kama ameficha mm. so hiyo time sasa ako tao ball iko hapa like shot okay like mm. iko hapa tukakuja tukaonana tuko tukaonana tukabonga eh nikamwambia akaniambia because anataka to spend time tuongee kiasi that time na doze nyambi nitumia na zenye niko nazo singe afford kuchukua nyumba hapo Nairobi mm. ama anything accommodation or place nini nikamwambia acha tutafute mta nyingine yenye inaingiana na mfuko yangu twende tukatulie huko mm. like tutafute place huko to we talk mm. about us mm. tukiwa huko mm. So sisi hao tukapata nikafikiria mtaa yenyeza pata nikaona eh hey, nikishuka gidhu mm. naweza naweza pata naweza pata place fit naweza mm-hmm. naweza naweza inatosha na mfuko wangu So tukaingia gari za gidhu tukaguda gidhu nikatafuta place kupata accommodation tukatulia hiyo ni daytime sasa kupata mm. na msichana sasa hiyo ndo the first day sasa nikaona ball yake fit mm. tukaongea kongea everything kongea mm-hmm. hapo like nikamwambia tu ni fit mm-hmm. uh, because hii hii si kuanga plan yangu hii ni mm-hmm. plan ya god na tunafa to accept Kenya ime mm-hmm. Kenya imetokea so mimi hapo si msichana akaniambia because yeye yeah, hajatosheka kukana mimi nafaa kulala tunafaa kulala hapo because niko nipa hiyo room he ran for 24 hours na tume run day time so usiku akani pressurize tutulie huko because ajaniona for long anataka tuonane huko nikamwambia z aita make au jamwambia uko na bibi ah your time mm yeye anajua niko tao niko aso na haso your time anajua kan niko na wife eh your time wako anajua kan niko na wife sami kama mimi na mimi ka job Kenya nishapata ndo naona tu kanaweza ni manage mm-hmm. sasa si zilala wapi si zilala huku so mm. tunafaa turudi twende wapi turudi wewe tufikie tao au urudi shule mm. na mimi nirudi nirudi place nilikuwa naishi ndo kesho yake niamkie niende job unaona so that time akaniambia ndo alifunguka roho akaniambia mimi by the way ile time nikwambia jana nimerudi shule mm. si kurudi shule mm-hmm hiyo jana wote akurudi shule aliandanga akakuja kuostiwa na bishti yake huko Nairobi place inaitwa Kikuyu sasa huko ndo amekuwa akiishi sio kwa shule uh, na wazazi wanajua wazazi wa shule wazazi wake shule niko kataa alikataa ma like ali feel like hezi ka shule akiwa na ball so hakuna mtu alikuwa anajua hata wazazi <laughs> wazazi wake walienda na yeye akamlipia fee walikuwa nafikiria kwa shule lakini yako kwa best yake yako kwa best yake mhm yako kikuyu kwa best yake so after ameniambia sasa tuko town sasa ndo ameniambia mimi unajua mimi nimeanakaaga town <laughs> mulizo nakaaga town aje akaniambia mimi ile time nikombe na rudi shule sikurudi na kanga na best yangu wa nikamwambia like kama unakaa na best yako tao na unaona ball ishakuwa big na ujaanza clinic na unajua wewe huko nyumbani ashaanza clinic wewe mm. jaanza clinic inafaa tu organize tuone vile 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 utaanza clinic unaona mm. akaniambia ni sawa nikamwambia ukifika kwa best yako uta utaongea na best yako uone atakuweka follow ndo tujue utaanzia clinic wapi unaona mm. Kaniambia ni sawa na tukaongea na akarudi. Mimi hiyo usiku, hiyo mm. siku nilikuwa nimelala, mm-hmm. akanipigia usiku akaniambia like eh, best yake mm. ilimuuma sana. Mm-hmm. Like amekuja kujua tulikuja kupatana na yeye. Mm-hmm. Tao. Unajua yeye akwambia best yake tunakuja kupatana. Yeah. So best yake ikamuuma sana because alikuja kupatana na yeye tao. So mm-hmm. best yake ikaka like ni kama sasa yeye ametosha kunini kum accommodate. Mm-hmm. So tukaorganize akaniambia yeye anataka kurudi nyumbani. Hapa hakuna hadha. He said Abidi amekuja ho, huku home. Home kwako. Huku kwao oh, sasa wow. huku kwao. Sasa itabidi maparo akuje okay. juu. Maparo okay. yake akuje juu sasa kana kuoga okay. na ball. Yeah. 
eh, nikamwambia mwanzo usikuje 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 matu usikuje matu kama unaweza ada tafuta place nyingine uishi huko nikamwa akaniambia manze ana hadha wise mimi kama mwanaume nikamwambia because niko na kasa mkash nitakuchukulia nyumba kidimani uishingi kidimani mpaka ile time utajifungua ukishajifungua utakuja madu mstana akaniambia ni saa ni sawa nikamwambia ndea vitu shule ukishaendea vitu shule uniambie nitakuwa nisha organize kidimani wende uanze kuishi kidimani nitakuwa nisha piga simu nikatafutiwa kanyumba kidimani uanze kuishi huko ka single room hapo mstana kwenda kwenda shule moranga kufika shule aka change mind akaamua yaezi aezi fanya nini aezi ishi aezi ishi kidimani because ball ishakuwa big kuna vitu aezi jifanyia kama kufua aezi fua sasa ataanza kukaa aje kidimani solo so akaniambia because sasa yeye ana feel like because ishaikuwa ishakuwa acha kuje wapi acha kuje home kwao msichana akakuja home kwao made yake akapata kona ball sister yake akapata kona ball watu wao akapata kona ball mzazi wake akapata kona ball mm. the only thing yenye lifanyika after lipatikana kona ball uh, the mother called me mm-hmm. because msichana aliopen up akamwambia about me the mother called me kongana na eh nikamwambia ni ukweli ball mm. yangu mimi sina mm. shida na nini mm. eh we agreed nikamwambia mimi niko sawa kama mm. mtoto ndale mm. ndale mtoto mimi sina shida mm. akaniambia ni sawa mm. so mtana akaanza kuishi home akaishi home akaishi home na yeye wangu huko home akaanza clinic alikuwa shaanza clinic alikuwa anaenda hapa matu eh msichana because taki na eh hey, aende matu clinic pale matu osi apatanie na wife hapo nikamtafutia usi ngine private hospital iko pale mbele wakaanza wangepatana na wife kwani wangejuana wangejuana because mm. uh, there is a time nikiwa na wife wangu mm. um sana like nilikuwa gani meka kwa garari yangu nilikuwa na some photos mm. zake mingi oh, sana some conversations mm-hmm. So wife wangu alikuwa anajua ni kama that time I was cheating. Ndio ajui kama Saina cheat. Hakuwa anajua picha ya huyo mwingine. Aliona aliona chat. Aliona chat akaona picha nini nini. Oh. Eh, so angemwona kwa hosi angejua. Angemwona hosi angemjua. So nikaona acha msichana tumtafutie hosi nyingine anze kwenda nga clinic kwa hosi hiyo nyingine. Hmm. Msichana akaenda clinic hapo, kaenda clinic kanda clinic mpaka i time ikafikia like wamebakisha like two months wajifungue wote wawili saa nikasema let let them ni wafanyie scan nijue like watajifungua hmm. lini au alikuwa caring man uh, ah alikuwa very caring because hata huyu mwingine kupata mimba hukumwachilia haukumpea stress mahali uh, bado alikuwa na mpush si kumpea stress eh? si kumpea stress then wakaka one mwezi mmoja ndio wapate mtoto no like one and a half month wa difungue like stand and kind and kumfanyia you ex sasa hiyo side chick nikana ngamfanyia scan scan yake kama one ikanionyesha atajifungua mwezi wa 5 mm. date 12 mm. ya wife nikaenda tukafanya nikapata atajifungua mwezi wa 5 date 8 Rona, kuna chana na 4 days. Wameachana na 4 days. Na wakiwa wameachana na 4 days, watoto bado wanataka kubaiwa zile vitu zote, zile zile vitu zote. Wale mtoto wezi za mtoto ka ka kadogi lazima umbaye vitu nini 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 nini. Umpange. Sasa hiyo time nikakuwa na hardships mingi sasa because that time after ni scan ni nionyesha hivyo na niko town na wamebakisha one month na kitu sasa so, ilibidi niache ile job yangu tao ikuje huko nyumbani mhm with the hiyo same nilikuwa nayo sasa nikatoka tao nikakunja huko nyumbani ndio sasa nikae na wife ndo ajifungue na huyo mwingine ndo ni shughulikie huyo mwingine afanye nini mm-hmm. ajifungue sasa eh siku moja nikaambia nikatoka home mm-hmm. nikakuja huko soko 
kule huko soko nilikuwa nimearrange nipatane na umstana umstana ako na ball kwa ni arrange tupatane hiyo mm. siku tupatane tujibambe like a feel ameniona mm. atosheke like a feel ako fit ameniona because mm. niko home unaona mm. na nikiwa home sometimes na anampigia simu na kosa kushika nini 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 mm-hmm. so ikabidi ni tu arrange siku nikuja hapa soko tuonane mm-hmm. so hiyo day tukakuja tukapatana tuka tukabonga tukafanya all that shit si ako na ball sasa like sasa hiyo time ni kama anabakisha 3 to 4 weeks ndo uh-huh. ajifungue 3 uh-huh. to 4 weeks hapo ndo ajifungue na wife ndo ajifungue uh-huh. yote time tulikuja tukashinda na yeye huku uh-huh. hiyo mchana yote hadi jioni uh-huh. jioni after ilifika mimi nikaenda home kwenda home nikafika home nikiwa nimechoka So your time una then we fika late hours hapa saa 2 na unajua ushagoa tu lala mapema sika oh. huko soko oh. then we fika home late nikafika hapo nikapata like nikaa kila mtu nikaa kila mtu anataka kudoza oh. so your time na mimi nimechoka nika refresh hapo ka shower oh. alafu nikaingia nikaingia zangu bed yeah. ni, ni pumzike oh. ni lale uh-huh. so your time after nilingia bed kulala Jui ni shetani ama ni nini mm. like hiyo time hiyo time nilikuwa nimeka simu yangu silent mm. nimeingia kwa nyumba nime refresh nini nini hakuna mtu ameniuliza nimeshinda wapi unajua mm. so nika nikaingia bed nikalala after nililala nikazima like si kujisikia nikazima totally kabisa kumbe naye ule mde mtu umeshinda naye huku soko Huyo huyo wife wangu mwingine huko soko mwenye tumepatana na yeye tumeshinda na yeye na yeye after kufika home ameenda kupiga shawa akipiga shawa akapata na zile labor pain na mimi nimefika home na nimelala yeye amefika huku time ya kupiga shawa si huko soko nimekwambia watu lala masaa 4 masaa 5 mm. ile time anaenda kupiga shawa ndo ingie bed akapata na labor pain ile majio mtoto ikapasuka anza kutoka kanza kutoka. Hiyo time kwanza kutoka alikuwa anaishi na madhe yake, akaenda akambia mama yake, akatoka bafu akambia mama yake. Sasa hiyo time akapelekwa osi. Na osi yenyepelekwa, wife wangu ndo atakaa. Ndo alikuwa aenda kujifu, kujifungulia huko. Hiyo time aka try ku reach. Sikusikia because nimelala na sikusikia. Totally sikusikia. Juu Nililalanga kabisa sijui nini nilizimanga hiyo siku sikusikia Sasa Moni Moni ndo nilisikia bike motorbike ikikuja kwa gate ikipiga iki, iki, iki horni ikipiga horn hapo home Kutoka nikapata ni brother yangu amekaa Kumbe amekaa kumwambia wazazi wangu wife wake Mm. wakoosi alikuwa anajifungua usiku alimpeleka usiku akoosi ashajifungu mm. ashajifungua nikikuja anakuja kuambia saa wazazi mm. saa yeye ndo amekuja kuja kuambia wazazi wangu sasa mm. si ni brother yangu anakuja kuambia wazazi wangu wife yake amejifungua usiku na akoosi mm. mimi asubuhi naamka hiyo time sasa sijaangalia simu after brother yangu alisema hivyo kwenda kuangalia simu nikapata missed calls ha? kama 34 mystical almost kwa 34 38 mystical za na text nikafungua online nikapata hey msichana niambia ati ashadimitiwa ako si wa alafu brother yangu amekuja moni ameambia wazazi wife yake yako wapi mm. oh see the same same hospital za nikashindo like uh, apo ni tayaldo aje sasa kimwana ume nikasema uh, stambia mtu like uh, nita sort kivyao so hiyo nika try kumpigia simu nikimpigia simu ashiki mm. nikipiga saa hiyo simu yake ashiki mm. so nika organize na brother yangu nikamwambia jioni by saa nane nataka unikujie twende na wewe wapi oh si hapo kwa hiyo si yenye umetoka juu kuna mtu ananiambia kwa wapi ako si sitaki kumwambia ati kuna mtu ako wapi ako hiyo si mm. sasa si brother yangu akakuja akanifetch akani tukakuja huku soko 
ukapiga round kiasi na shindo nitamwambia aje. Mm. Hiyo time nikipiga simu ya msichana hakuna mtu anashika. Mm. E, ikafika ikafika round 6 hapo tukaenda tukanunua vitu. Sasa unajua mimi sasa naona like ni kama msichana alijam kacha kushika simu na leo maybe anisha jifungua na akatoka osi. Yeah. That's why ahongei mm. na labda naona nikao usiku nilimle mm. nilimlenga. Mimi nikaambia brother angu because unaenda kuona wife wako tunaweza endanisha na wewe twende tuone wife wako mm. because amejifungua. Sisi si hao tukatoka hapa tukafanya shopping tukaenda osi. Kufika osi kumbe watu wakijifungua wanaekangwa kwa room moja. Wenye wamejifungua wanaekangwa kwa kwa ward. Wenye wamejifungua wanakoga kwa karumu kao. Na tutoitoa hapo like like au uh, mix na wenye wanakuja kujifungua mm. like hivyo sasa sasa kwenda osi tukapata kumbe watu wakijifungua na peleka kwa place moja yeah. your time si kwa najua because si kwa ni shey enda kwa leba kwa 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 world place wenye watu wanazaliaga sisi si hao na brother yangu tumebeba shopping nao tukafika hapo tukaingia sasa kuingia tukapata na yule msichana <laughs> kona katoi Sista ke ako apo, mama ke ako apo, alafu efu abradangu ako kwa iso idingine bedi ko apo, mm-hmm. namstia na ako ako kwa iya katikat, nayo tayi misi kwa sasa ni shei patana na familia yao, mm-hmm. ile lai tuko tuna shindanga tuna onge ako asim, mm-hmm. nayo me fika nayo pata mstia na ame jifungua, ko na mto iya apo, sista ke apo, na efu abradangu apo. Mm-hmm. Sa baati, <laughs> siju ni baati ya mani nene. After tulingi hapo, after kufika kwa hizo mavitanda, simu yangu ikapigwa. Sa kupigwa ilikuwa na makelele. Uwagi hapo ni kwa wall na atensho. Eee, kaleta atensho. Eee, kalilia sana. Mm-hmm. Kila mtu wakani yungaya say, nika, ikabidi nime, nime stoka enje kiasi. Sa hiyo temi nitoka enje, uh, nikanda nkatulia hapo enje kwa wall, zile viti zina kuwaga hapo. Nikambia brother angu, Enda umambia wife wako, come, tuonanie uku inje because uko ndani, kuna kani kaa kumeja. Unajua saizo ni metense, mm. ile kushtuka. Nimeshtuka ni aje like, uh, itanzia wapi. Mm. Itanzia eh, wapi. Like sasa hii ndani. So orienda? Sasa nika, nika bidi sasa sister home, sister katoka hapo inje, mm-hmm. nakudia kanigotea. Ami kanda ni kaona mtoi, kapata demo ni jifungua kabebi kabebi gal, katoto. Uliongea na family? Eh? Yeah. Family uliongea na wao? Eh, family ni wagotea tu, kongea mm. nini. Uyu dee wa baba mtoto. Udo baba mtoto. Eh, <laughs> mm. wakajundi wa baba mtoto. Nini nini, mi kawambia pole, mi lete mwanko na mpigia simu. Siku wana, niko ni mezima, niko ni melala, siku sikia simu. Mm-hmm. Na mchana ni meshinda ni kipiga simu. So what happened later? Uh, what happened later, after mchana mekua discharged, mm-hmm. amerudi home. Mm-hmm. Sasa mi si waifu wa brother angu sasa si, amejifungwe yo day na waifu wa mchana. Mm-hmm. Waifu wa brother angu na yaka kuwa discharged. Sasa ni karudi sasa, ni goje na ya wife, my wife, mm-hmm. time yake kifika, hajifungwe. Kakaka like uh, because you 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 must change your mezza date that mm. April that year da so kaka we found a kujia kujifungua date uh, we found a kujia kujifungua date ten we zivatano we only a kujifungua that we zivaine mm. kaka like ten days we found a kujifungua. Fungu kujifungua. Same hospital. The same hospital. Mm-hmm. Kajifungua. Mm. Kajifungua ka baby mm. boy. Mm. So after nijifungua ka baby boy, akarudi home. Tukarudi na ye home, tukanza kushika family. Kwa sasa kuna, sasa sasa ni kama nisha kuwa baba. Mm. Ona? Mm. So tukaka, mm. na no, unajua no, sasa ule msichana lizali woko, the, the baby girl. Mm-hmm. Mindo ni mpeanga jina. Mm. Uh, those who compare the third name, mm. the first name, 
and the second name akapewa na mama yake mama ya msichana sasa mother in law dada saida eh walitikia wali bidi uitikie okay kuna other okay. ways cause bado una waficha bado wanafikiria one day one time uh, utaoa msana yetu <laughs> in fact <laughs> Eh walikuwa nataka ni home stay na wao yeah. kabisa. Hiyo uh-huh. time wako unajua like uh, ni kama niko na family. Okay. Eh so walikuwa nataka ni home stay. Nikamwambia nitamwoa miss na shida. Mhm. Uh-huh. Eh we organize everything then ndakuja nitamchukua. Mhm. Tukakaa na msichana, kaanza kumlea, kaanza kumlelea kwa wife wangu, kaanza kumlea sawa wife wangu, kaka like mamake anataka aende hapa su. Amedi yule ngoja medic ndio tamo aende asome eh aende asome mm. aende asome afanya course alafu after she shafanya course because the mother was saying that she will follow dear herself atamsomesha unaona mm. oh, mm-hmm. like kama anataka like am um, grab kwanza aende asome alafu dirudishiwe wife unaona mm-hmm. mm. sasa that kind of in me sasa mimi kamwambia mimi sina shida kama unataka kwenda kusomesha msichana sawa because me iko na plan kusomesha mshtana nikisha grow nikisha settle sasa sasa mm-hmm. so, nikamwambia ni sawa nikampea mshtana karudi kwa mshtana nikamrudisha kwa sasa so, ikakuwa like tuna commute akitaka kuniona na kuja home mm-hmm. maparo wangu akitaka kumuona wanaenda kwao nikitaka kuona mtu yeye ananiletea home ukiwa na function nyumbani anakuja tunakaa naye one week Now you are real life. Now you are real real wife now. Eh, my real. Sasa unaishi na yeye. Eh, huyu eh, mwingine ajai kanyanga kwetu. In fact aji kwetu hadi sasa hii. The only person mwenye anajua kwa familia yetu anajua brother yangu. Huyo brother yangu mwenye wife wake walijifungua na na yeye usi. Ndio anamjua. Aji the other the other nini. Yaani mtu anajua the, that lead ni brother yako pekee. Brother yangu ndo anajua wazazi ana wazazi wangu ajika na kuanga na na mtoto ni wewe na brother yako Brother yangu ndo anajua totally ndo anajua So huyu mwingine uh, alichukuliwa na wazazi sasa hiyo na wife Yo eh, alichukuliwa na wazazi wao wa msomeshe Aya alisema atamsomesha lakini bado ni wife wangu Kwa nini haukukaa na, na wewe hakukaa na wewe uh, asomeshwa akiwa kwako Like uh, a mom Mm. And that passed long long time ago so like amelelewa na single parent ah mm-hmm. sometimes because kwa hiyo kwa hiyo family yao wamezaliwa watano wa mm-hmm. three brothers hapo mm-hmm. na mama mawili mm-hmm. two sisters ah mm-hmm. uh, like mimi niliona like because the other two guys wakaangi nyumbani then the last born the the two the two nini so ende akalisha mama eh ende akalisha mama ni kama mama alikuwa anataka ende akae na yeye at least akuwa anamuona na because mimi unajua sometimes like mtu akishajifungua uh-huh. there are some things they anafaa to learn na mimi sikuwa najua bado like kulea mtoto mtoto anataka ngaje nikaona uh-huh. bado ni fiti ende asome show hizo vitu na mama yake so mtoto vile sasa bibi yako alijifungua mm. umesema mlikana naye for how long huyo wangu mm. ama alichukua immediately na wazazi after alijifungua mm. after alijifungua tulikana na eh, like tukumalizanga wiki because nobody knows how to handle the kid sasa hii huyo mtoto wako wa wife yako mm. akwa na miaka gapi ama miezi gapi sasa hiyo mtoto alizaliwa last year mwezi wa tano date 10 mm-hmm. na huyo mwingine msichana alizaliwa last year mwezi wa 4 date mm. 30 huyu bibi your ex girlfriend yeah. bado unampenda uh, in fact that is the amazing lady i've ever met uh, upstairs a coffee kila kitu ako sawa like uh, she's pretty a coffee like the lady a coffee like a coffee no radio me personally nataka gang mtu apa kiakili yako sawa. Mm. Despite of that nini ile beauty, the physical beauty. Mm. Nataka ngapia mtu upstairs ako fit. Haya. So, sasa huyo mm. uh, stake ko ko um, uh, uh, just do the comparison mm. between your ex and your wife. Mm. Uh, 
that is okay umem swali ni hii bado unampenda nani your ex girlfriend mwenye sasa bado wako na mtoto <laughs> mama briana <laughs> eh. uh, mama briana nampenda do you still meet uh, occasionally occasionally yeah. do you think like mm. huyu mwingine vile alichukua na wazazi wake yeah. wanakupatia more space ya kukuja karibu na bibi na na, na ex girlfriend uh, pardon vile sasa huyu mwingine amechukuliwa na wazazi mm. your ex girlfriend anaweza kuja kwako na anaweza taka sana muishi mm. na yeye si ndio huyo yeah. wazazi hawajamu limits hawajamwambia wewe kaa nyumbani nikusomeshe yeye ako na freedom ya movements eh yeah, movements ako na freedom of movements you say nikimpigia simu tunaweza onana so saa hii akikuja mahali unaishi yeah. for 2 to 3 weeks yeah. Your real wife will not know. Uh, as a man, you have to, the first thing you have to respect your family. Aha. Uh-huh. Eh uh-huh. kuna vitu uh-huh. Like say to say me for instance the, the other lady she is him later nyumbani simply because in later msichana mwingine home. Unaona? Uh-huh. So the only thing that we do ni kulea mtoto na tunaifikisha Now you as a man what do you think do you want to marry both of them Uh see the same man as I know my boy Willy but uh now apenda utawasa okay watu wawili kuna mtu anajua huyu mwingine anajua uko na ex girlfriend mwenye ako na mtoto wako na huyu mwingine anajua uko na wife mwenye pia ako na mtoto wako My wife There is a day tulikuwa tume tumekosana kiasi because za zile asira uh, we were chatting via 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 Facebook eh? mm-hmm. nikamtumia picha ya mtoto nikamwambia mm-hmm. eh hata niko na mtoto mwingine mahali pia analea so like kaka like ni kama eh ule mstana na nikamwambia kale kastana kaliza alafu after a while nikakuja nikaruka hiyo story nikamwambia hizo zilikuwa ga story mm-hmm. so huwa anashuku anashuku ni kama like huyo mstana akona akona mtu wa huyu ex girlfriend mmoja akona mtoto wako na wife ni nani huyo mnapatana sana uh... <laughs> Haya ndio hiyo acha nisikulizie hapa kwa kamera kwa sababu <laughs> baby wanaweza kuwa wanasema <laughs> unaweza toa kidoda maybe amewahi kusamehea so ungependa wajuane watu wawili uh, Kenya naweza penda mm. si lazima wajuane lakini naweza penda watoto wajuane mm-hmm. simply because uh, Kenya nataka my plan eh, ni if nataka ni create some negotiations nione kama nikienda kwa msichana watanipe kaka baby girl nikienda kwa msichana watanipe huyu baby boy mm. nianze like nianze kubonga na eh nianze kubonga na nianze kukaa so how will that family. happen watoto wanajuana na wazazi hawajuani uh, the first thing because uh, wife wangu alikuwa na aniletee mtoto sep mm se anafaa kuniachia kwa ka baby boy. Mm. Na huyu mwingine mamake anakuwa gaeva ready. Nikimwambia mm. nataka kuoa msichana wake na nimemtoka mm. okay, mzendo chukua msichana. So unachukua huyu mtoto na huyu mwingine mnaenda mahali. Hapana. Ama unamleta kwa wife. Ah ah. Mimi okay. Kenya naweza taka sana. Mm. Na uh, because nilikuwa nimedilia watoto sana. Kenya naweza taka sana ni hao watoto like ni kisha kuwa well up mchukua hao watoto mishi mm. na wao kama baba hao watoto ukiishi okay, like, na wao ni nani ni, ni nani utaacha ni mama gani utaacha ni wife ama ni ex kwanza nitawaacha wote nitawaacha <laughs> <laughs> wote kwanza yeah. <laughs> so utawaacha ubaki na mtoto na watoto eh nataka nikuwe na hiyo family mm. nikuwe na mtoto mm. nikuwe na kaka dem nikuwe na kaka boy do you think sahi mm. 
your ex girlfriend na your wife wakijuana inaweza kuwa leta shida haezi leta shida Siblik because ni kitu cha happen you can't run away from reality mm. because ni kitu cha happen mm. yep the last question about this kaka mama umerudia what do you think now between those two ladies eh za what is your take okay. as a man okay uh, because the other lady mm. alikuja karudi shule sharudi shule mm. after alijifungua alijifungua mwezi wa 4 mm. na september karudi shule mm. so sharudi shule sasa hivi sasa hivi ako long holiday sasa hivi we talk so ana graduate by next year mm. so na yule mwingine anaingia shule by by sep mm. kenya naweza staka like decision yangu eh uh, because mimi personally uh, nikidate na mtu nataka nga kumpa ile space kidogo afanye shughuli zake mimi nifanye shughuli zangu because sasa ni, ni kama like tuseme sasa ni kama ni sha console marriage mm. ni kama sasa na commute hapa na commute hapa point mm. commute hapa na commute hapa mm. so the only thing inaweza fanya sasa hii mm. uh, if what accept mm if what accept because mm. kitu kwanza inajua wife hizi ni wife mwenye nimeoa sasa hizi nikataza huyo kijana wangu mm. nataka nipe huyo kijana wangu kwanza niishi na kijana wangu niende kwa kina huyo msichana mwingine nichukue mtoto mwingine the baby girl mm. nianze kuishi na yeye pia na huyo mtoto mwingine from there after a while sasa nikisha settle then ndajua nitajipanga ndajua first of all yeah. <coughs> with the analysis that i can give you yeah. i can see you are very caring man very caring at least sasa unaelewa mm. unaelewa wa unaelewa vile unafaa kusaidia familia yako first of all haukuna mahali unasema staki huyu nataka huyu staki huyu nataka huyu yeah. and your wife unampeda Eh wife wangu nampenda. Eh nampenda sana in fact. Sasa yuko hivi. Haujui which is which. <laughs> both, both of the ladies mm. are coffee. The only thing they like unajua when you are married kuna kila time like mimi personally nikioa. Mm. Nilikuwa nataka dem akona kale ka ukienyeji kidogo. Huyo mwingine side chikana kale ka ukienyeji bati akona ako hapa lakini waifa akona akona kwa ukienyeji kidogo <laughs> unajua sasa ukioa ukioa unajua mimi nimeleleoa pastor nimeleleoa shago mm-hmm. nini nini mm-hmm. siwezi enda wa mtu pale ni mimi niko na shamba nikamwambia babe eh, kuna kukuzi kwa hapa tunafaa kutangalia like wezi <laughs> Uwezi enda example well, like at a stem in the means you we mtu enda kalime like uh-huh. when the one to be to be as na progress mm-hmm. eh hey, ivo lakini the other lady sasa huyo mwenye mama Briana huyo mm-hmm. ni mama Raymond mm-hmm. huyo ni mama Re- Briana mm-hmm. yeah ah watu sasa hivi ile mkoma tu wanaishi tu huku mama Briana mm-hmm. anaishi huku do ni mkikuyu anaishi Ula anaishi huku wamerendu huku to huku si kuwa kwa ni mora mama beriana ni ex ex girlfriend yep. na wife mama raymond anaishi wapi wow ni huku nasema place bado ni matu wato wako matu ya yeah, wako within matu kuna vile tuneza enda tuwaone eh, tuneza enda kwanza tuone wife eh. tutembe alafu tukitoka Haya. hapo tuneza enda tuone. tukitoka hapa tuende kwa wife kwa sababu hapa inaweza leta vita sasa Yeah. Do you think you can break the cocoon? Do you think unaweza mwambia ukweli? Wefu wangu? Eh. Wefu wangu naweza mwambia ukweli? Eh. Uh, because uh, ni kuanga na plan, na future plan na yeye. Mm-hmm. Unajua huyo ni mtu tulikaa chini tukashedo. Unajua mm-hmm. marriage si kitu unaweza uende upange na mtu mwambie wewe. Mm-hmm. Unajua tumekaa sana na tutaka kukuoa. Kama tumekaa sana tunafaa tuoane. Like ni kitu ilijileta. Mhm. Like and in the 
mm. the right process yeah. because I, so, what i'm thinking maybe ako ni mtu wa social media like oh kula kienyeji kienyeji ni like nimekwambia my wife <laughs> Mimi ni kwambia personally ni ni choose mtu uh-huh. aja aja like <laughs> ako fiti kimwangalia ko fiti uh-huh. lakini uh, kuna vitu vingine ndani hadi unasahau na muita yule kienyeji ah uh, <laughs> si yule kienyeji mm. like ako na something hapo ndani yake like that's uh-huh. when you may prefer oh, yeah, that yeah. 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 it's okay it's okay yeah. you know what you mean yeah. it's uh-huh. Yeah because uh, because uko na future plan na yeye. Mm. Hii mko nimesema nitatumia kili zangu mm. ni mjanja rushe ni mpe ujanja yenye anafaa kuwa nayo. Because uh-huh. the other lady bado ako na ujanja mm. acha yeye atumie tactics zake. Mhm. Ah uh, tumie ujanja yake wife wangu ndatumie ujanja yangu. Ni mpeleke oh, kwa lady oh. nataka. So which means eh hey, hey. The ex unamwamini sana yani. Yani ni bright, ako na decision anaweza make na ziwe successful. But wife, um, ni wewe unafaa umpange. Those are the two different ladies. The reason why I'm talking more about my ex mm. is because my ex is more presentable than the wife. Because sasa hii ningekuwa na mabisho wangu hapa bogi sasa wanataka kuona family yangu. Tuseme sasa hii inaitwa like uh, like uh, like on occasion mm. we unafaa kuenda na family yako mm. mimi personally ninge choose niende na ex wangu if tunaenda nyumbani i'll go mm. with my wife ama please tunaenda kupatana na family members naenda na wife lakini personally if tunaenda kujibamba tunaenda place na naenda na wewe ex wangu hey hey men <coughs> ladies Hebu tueleze. Mm. Mtu mjaja hivi anakaje? Ni nini anaweza kuambia usikie yeye ni mjaja? Kama huyo your ex. Uh, Ai nitamani sana nimuone. Uh, your ex natamani sana nimuone. Uh, yaani ni mjaja kiasi. Yaani ni mtu anaweza kaa chini ya kuambia. Uh, uh, ni mtu anakumanee jama ni mtu anaweza kumanee. Ni mtu anakaje huyo? My ex. Eh. Uh, Ajo mimi I'm so choosy because uh oh see mabona ya beauty about beauty no see ma, see mabona beauty uh, uh, yani uh, in terms of lifestyle yake yani lifestyle ya ex wangu uh-huh. eh ex wangu ana peda happy yup amelelewa na ile like as uh, you know na kwambia aje na cause na jaribu kuona vile una jaribu kumwet <laughs> kum <laughs> Okay, kuligana ile sample umepeana mm. kama ni out hivi nini? Is she a very young lady? My ex. Eh. Wote wana range hapo 22. Mm. Yep. Wife yako <coughs> but is aya ko college. Sahi si ndo nakwambia sasa because sasa sasa pataka mtoto ndo anataka ingie by September. Huyu mwingine ako shule anabuda. Who, who is more talkative? Is it your ex or your wife? Uh, both of them are talkative. Wezi boyeka in fact ukiwa like see the same man ukiwa naona boyekaanga. Lakini my wife there is something that ananifanyaga then you mwingine ex wangu hizi nifanyia. Hey. Yeah. Uh, so it is difficult to know. So <clears throat> wakijua hii story Do you think you will lose both of them? Uh, and when you lose both of them? Me in fact sina plans za kulose mtu. Ama utasema mwenye anakupenda atakurudia. I know I won't say that. Huh? I, I, I have to fight for what for what I want as a uh-huh. man. Huh? Mm-hmm. Uh, in case kuko na any issue I'll fight for what I want. Huh? Mm-hmm. Uh, I'll try to solve it. Huh? Wow. <clears throat> That's a very interesting story. I think the <laughs> the best thing is sisi tuende tuone hawa kama wako within we can just go and visit them. Na that was a wife. <laughs> wife anakali kama 
mumekuja tunaweza salimiana asanteni wageni edenye nyumbani so <laughs> huyu mwingine sasa anakaa kutuambia ah sasa tukaeni hapa kwanza tuongee hamwedi sahi so huyo tunaweza waste time tunaweza kuwa na time mingi na yeye sana anaweza tuzuia tukae tu mm. so bibi ju nakaa ni mpole yani hana mambo mingi mm. eh, tunaweza enda kwanza tumsalimie wife wangu yeah sawa hiyo ina shida tutaenda tusalimie muone ka kijana hapo eh <laughs> eh uh, ina shida hiyo so we go yeah we can go guys let's go and see who are these wonderful ladies of mr who ah, mr somba <laughs> ah, mr somba yep there we go